Isaiah Pacheco receives the first handoff and goes down the sideline. Nicely done by Vedral. It's another first down here for Rutgers. Pacheco cuts left, touchdown, Scarlet Knights. That was huge. Scarlet Knight offense marching down the field against Michigan State on its first drive. Langan will keep it, and how about that? He gets the touchdown. Rutgers up 14-0, leading to the touchdown. And it's a 14-0 lead for the visitor. Third time in six drives that Rutgers starts in Michigan State territory. Here's Vedral. Touchdown. Vedral trying to take it all the way. He'll get it done. In for another Rutgers touchdown. He runs him off on the bottom, and it opens up the middle. And Simmons slips. That one slip by Simmons is the difference in the play. Still playing man, single high. Bringing the pressure, oh. here's Pacheco. Oh, He'll cut all. it outside to the left. He has a couple of defenders to beat and pushed out of bounds by Trey Person. For the bat, watch this. This is designed to go jump up inside, but he sees it to the outside. Tackle does a good job of kicking his hips, and then he just turns on the speed. See, that's what you don't expect from Pacheco with Langham. A handoff this time to Pacheco. Pacheco He'll dive in for the touchdown. That is impressive, Lisa. That was an impressive drive. This is a completely different football team. They're playing with phys of the physical presence. They're playing smart. Just 10 seconds into the contest when Raekwon Jones returned a fumble. Rutgers has it. Skipping to the outside. Noah Vedral on the carry. Noah Vedral takes the shotgun snap. Vedral tucks it down and he'll jog out of bounds inside of Indiana territory, a first down. Adams alone. King Ron Adams on the sprint. They won't catch it. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. King Ron Adams. Up a nice block. Watch 71 right there. Comes down. And then they all came around. Haskins does a nice job on that. And then once he gets to that next level. This one, quarterback launching himself across the 40, picks up the first down. You could see some of Scott Frost's misdirection with Vedral from their time together in Nebraska. Rutgers operating in Indiana territory. Karon Adams hits the hole. Adams inside the Indiana 30, another big gainer. A little bit different offense with Pacheco out of there, a little, a little quicker comes out to start things at the 36 yard line he's going to keep it had the option did not give it to Pacheco and a decent start with a four yard gain see they've struggled on third down conversions for the first two games here a little reverse Crookshank he's the speedster oh he stayed on his feet down the sideline what a play by Aaron Crookshank put him on the ground Good awareness by Crookshank. He knew right away that he didn't touch the ground. He keeps going. And if it's not for Sean Wade's effort, that's a touchdown. He kind of helps set the culture you want to have there in this Gataway. Little fake play, and that worked very well. Into the hands of Pacheco, and Pacheco in a foot race. And Isaiah Pacheco finally tracked down by Tyreek Smith inside the five. But that is a Big Ten standout presented by Auto Owners Insurance. Yeah, Pacheco just takes the direct snap. He's lined up in the tailback position, but he jumps in front of Vedral. Vedral acts like the ball goes over his head. He's only had 106 yards total on the entire ball game. Vedral, another trick play. How about this? Throwing it back to the left to the big man. Big O'Neal is eligible on the backside as the and man on the line of scrimmage. Langan, and there you go. There's that quarterback power run play. Langan takes it in behind the offensive line. The tight end comes back across the ball there. Langan, big body just goes right downhill and there's no one there on the defense to account for him. And Vedro will keep it and pick up about six or seven yards on that first carry. Kind of leading things here offensively. 
Isaiah Pacheco there in the backfield. He will take his first carry. He's got some space to move. He split a couple of Illini defenders across the 35 and a big run and a nice start for Rutgers. Wait for the hole to open up here. Sidesteps. And as Tariq Barnes getting a start today, just gets swallowed up by the Rutgers. He picked up over 2,000 rush yards under the guidance of Sean Gleason. Here's Adams. They said that he might get a little bit more reps here in this game. Pacheco now taking it outside. Good decision. He picks up the first down and he's rolling for more across the 25 yard line. Brown doesn't make the tackle. Watch 30 coming to your screen right there. He misses the tackle on Pacheco and then it's one on one on a couple of picks here in the game. Petro calls his own number and picks up the first down. They had Young come on the backfield. Hard hit by Barn. They can get it here. Pacheco cuts it to the outside and picks up the first down. He's still going out at about the 35. Go outrun Owen Carney. The angle and then get upfield before Adams can drag him down. A little stiff arm action there by Pacheco. Gets him a couple more yards. Now oh, Woodford's quickly down. For set, not going with tempo. And it's Aaron Young. Young to the edge on a snap inside the 15 and racing for the sideline. You have Crookshank out there as well. Do they do a sweep with him? Do they throw with Langan down here low? Langan looked left, runs right, stays on his feet, looking for his third rushing touchdown of the year, and he has it. Following said Reese Palant. He pulls around. Matt Alimo up there as well. And just look at him keep churning those legs. From their 40. Adams again, stood up, bounces out. Brad Hawkins will force him out, but not before Adams bounces off a tackle and fights off Hawkins to pick up more, more yardage of the first down. With tempo on offense. Four receivers bunch to the right side. Federal will keep it and is close to a first down. Now for the one, the snap to Langan and off the right side and into the end zone for the second time tonight. Rutgers, touchdown, four. And then two plays later, into the end zone for Johnny Langan for the second time in the game. And they'll dial up that coverage again here on third down, but they won't need it because Bedwell is running, and Bedwell's going to run for the first down. Are you kidding me? And that is an absolute backbreaker for Michigan's defense. And in their stances, a lot of times we'll have two plays in one. Let's see what they got here. Pacheco still on his feet and across the 30-yard line. Yeah, this is their bread and butter play. Oftentimes when Rutgers runs a hurry up offense, they'll get back into that specific play. He's running it, those defenders have to make the business decisions. Absolutely. Patient and a nice run for a first down. Comfortable in Sean Gleason's offense. We last saw him against Ohio State, as I mentioned, through 13 passes today. He's six of seven through the year. Ridge, New Jersey native. Spent last year as the OC at Oklahoma State. 17 trips into the red zone for Rutgers. 18 after the prior drive. 16 scores this year. Langan still churning. Down to the 12. She was pushing Jalen Alexander back. Meanwhile, Rutgers knocking on the door. A chance to pull ahead. Young. Still turning across the goal line. It's a touchdown. Excited for Rutgers. We're going to watch this play. Aaron Young right here takes it in. Puts his, lowers his head and just gets in there. But it's, once again, that void in the middle. So look at Isaiah Pacheco. And that may neutralize him on third and long. Federal will keep a design play. Federal stays on his feet right out of a tackle. First down. Not quite as much of a runner. So you're going to see this was planned. This is right off the start. Came from the sideline, everybody locks up on the outside, and Vedral just does a nice job of running through that first tackle. Luketa missed a tackle. I don't think he's thrown a complete completion yet this year. That's correct. The one is here, and Jesse Luketa swallows him up in the middle. Does have enough for the first down over the 35. Rutgers facing third down and seven. Good pocket for Vedral. He'll move to his left. Looking downfield, receivers covered. He'll keep it. 
I'll tell you in a moment after this play for the 18 for Nil Avedral, and he sights up to the sideline, stays in balance. Well done. Rutgers had four Big Ten wins over the last five seasons. They have two this year, an opportunity for another one next week and the week after. As Vedral will scramble here, and a downfield block enough for a first down, steps out inside the Penn State 45. He was injured in the season opener early on against Northwestern. Vedral on a quarterback keep has a lot of room. Vedral dancing near midfield, brought down at the 46. Ross was involved. That's how you can get after this Maryland defense. All that man coverage, everyone's back turned in the secondary. Noah Vedral that time. Vedral tucks it down and takes off. Picks up the first down yardage, gets all the way into Maryland territory. It's just been the quarterback draws, trying to find a way to weave through the rush, and then you have everyone's back turned. Vedral, oh. quarterback draw. Launching into this run, Vedral has plenty of room across the 35, and then he's drilled, knocked down by Ahmad McCullough. 25 yards. Yeah, and I think this has been their most successful run game so far. Not much going on the ground for Rucker. Elton wears one of those GPS trackers in practice. He runs about five miles a day in practice. In addition to that, he's running at 20 miles an hour all practice, and we're seeing some of that speed right here. Right now, 20 miles an hour for a touchdown. Well, how about the play design? Sean Gleason, we talked about the trick plays. Get it somehow into one of your best players on offense's hands, Bo Melton. Third down, seven heat. Zikowski on the quarterback key. Plenty of room. First down, Rutgers inside the Maryland 15. Not something you see a ton from Art Zikowski watching him on tape, but man coverage again, the quarterback drop. Just under 90 seconds left. Pacheco bouncing it out. Pacheco inside the 30. Scampers out of bounds. Rutgers deep in Maryland territory. We're talking about the character and the will of each and every Nebraska player. Lane finds a hole and a big run. So Art Sitkowski started the game at quarterback with Johnny Langan as a flag comes flying here. Pacheco's going to be kicking himself over that one. Yeah, that's the part of his game that he's really improved. And now they're going to run it. Sack with all kinds of space. First down to the 50. This kid does it all. What kind of impact that Corsac has in here? He just notices they have no contain. I'll take it. There's nobody out here. Up the middle, it is Pacheco. First down and more. How about a first down? Fourth down and one, and Isaiah Pacheco, watch him. The legs churning, runs physical to the end zone. Spot for him if he wants to become a coach. Up the middle, across the 50. Good run here on second and 21 by Langan. First time he did it with his, was his first career game as a freshman against Colorado. Now Johnny Langan in for Sitkowski, and he's going to take off. Thank you.